going to do an exercise for American Mahjong using the National Mahjong League card. This exercise is called Charleston Force because we're going to force hands in pre-selected categories. We'll only play hands in the pre-selected categories. This is a great exercise if you like to play in tournaments or maybe special events where they pre-select categories. The person who gets a Mahjong in one of those pre-selected categories goes home with a prize. If you're new to Mahjong, or if you already know how to play and just want to build your skills, consider subscribing to my channel. That way you won't miss anything. We're going to do three iterations. We'll alternate between dealer and non-dealer. So I will create a dealt hand and then a mock Charleston with no jokers for each one. Joker North, two, four, six, eight, two, eight, nine, pair two, three, four, five, eight. If these were your tiles, which of these would you force? And what would be your first pass? If these were my tiles, I would play 2468. 2468. I would not pick a hand yet. We're just going to gather. But I would probably try to build around the 2 bam and the 6 crack. Let's pass these three. 68. We only have two tiles to pass. Otherwise, we have all 2468. So this is where I would whittle down. We have a pair of eights here, no four bam. We could use a joker here though for the four bam. If we did say two four bam, four six crack, eight dot. There's a gap. We need one tile to pass, so let's let the eight bam go. all odds. This would be a pretty risky pass. So we have four, six, a joker. So I wouldn't play a pair hand. Let's break that up and pass one, two, five. Still a little bit risky. Six crack. That's a pung. Four, six, two, two, four, six, eight, two, four, we need a four bam, four, six, eight, two, four, I would keep the six because we could still do two, four bam, six, eight. Really, we don't even have to make a choice. We can just pass these three. Is there an offsuit dragon hand? Yes, there is. Two bam, we have a green dragon. We have no other two, so I would let it go. Two crack, two crack, two four, two four, two four, six eight, dragon. We're letting a pung go if we went with that hand. I wouldn't do that. I build around the pung, break those up. So let's do dragon or right across left, left we're going across. Let's pass these three. Sevens, no, let's pass these three. Woo, we did get a six and sevens now. I would not pass those. I think what I would do here is break up that four, pass one of each suit. Oh, wow, look at that. We got twos. Two, four, six, eight. I would just keep it all. 
discard those, play something 2, 4, 6, 8. We do have a gap, but here now we have 2, 4, 6, 8. If we can get the 8 ban, there is a 2, 4, 6, 8, 8 hand, fourth one down. But the 8s need to be pairs, so I probably wouldn't commit. But even getting 1, 8, bam could make that probably a pretty good hand to play. Then we could also consider 2, 4, 4, 6, 8. There's a gap, no 4, bam. If you would have done something differently, write it in the comment section below for force one. For now, two, four, six, eight. We have a joker, west south, three, eight, nine, pair nine in cracks, two, eight in bams, one, three, six, nine in dots. If these were your tiles, which of these would you focus on and what would be your first pass? If these were my tiles, I would build around consecutive run, eight, nine, maybe six, seven, eight, nine. I'd break up those wins. So let's do three, south, two, these three. Seven, six, seven, eight, nine, four numbers in a range. There is an offsuit dragon hand, 8989 dragon, 8989 dragon. This would be the right dragon for the cracks and dots, so maybe keep that. Let's pass these three. Seven crack, that is in our range, 6789. And we do have tiles to pass. This is a little bit risky being consecutive, but at least they're different suits. Oh my goodness, look what we got. This is very risky. <laughs> we just went right across left and we just sent this to the player to our left. I would not do that. Let's pass maybe those three. Seven, eight, seven, eight, nine, six maybe can go. Maybe that'll be better to do it this way. Six, six, seven, eight, nine. There was 369 in here, but we're forcing consecutive run. Here's a dragon, 7878 seven, dragon, but we have this multiple. Okay, so we need to give something up. 786789, 9, 7, 8, 6, 7, 8, 9. There is a one suit Pung Pung Kong Kong hand. Let's let this nine go. Threes, oh my goodness. Okay, so we're gonna have to whittle more. Seven, eight, six, seven, eight, nine in one suit. Let's let the seven go. Wait a minute. Eight, nine, seven, eight, no. I think that was good. Nine, eight, nine, eight, nine, eight, nine. Oh, look, we got an eight, eight, nine. Look at the threes. This I don't think is helpful, but I really don't like passing those. Six, seven, eight, nine. I think I would probably maybe pass these three for optional. One, two, three. 
Wow, one, two, three, and three. But here we have six, seven, eight, nine. Maybe we can use this to help with one of the pungs here. I would just gather. If we get a five crack, we might even be able to play five through nine. So that was a really rough Charleston, but we do have a hand with no gaps, six, seven, eight, nine. We need to force a year hand. We have wins and twos and a white dragon. Those have to go. So let's break up the three. Maybe do one of each suit. Three, one, five. Let's put an eight in there. We got an east, maybe the concealed hand. One, seven, four. Threes. Okay, dot, bam, crack. Seven, eight, dragon. There is a dragon hand, but look at all those wins. Let's pass three crack, eight bam, maybe eight crack, green dragon. Seven, eight, and two suits might be better. Let's do these three. There's a little bit of help. Another two and a north. News concealed year hand. Let's pass these three. Ones. I'm going to break those up. Maybe pass a two in there like that. Fives. Oh my goodness. And a, and a flower. I would not pass a flower. But I think we could probably say year hand concealed can be pretty good. Let's do these for optional cross. No keepers. But we have a hand, 2022 with news. We do have a gap, but we can use jokers. Because that west would be a pung. Five discards, that's one more than I like to have, but this is not too bad of a result for forcing a hand. Your hand. Forcing hands is a great skill to build, not just for playing in competitive events or maybe a special event where they have prizes for those pre-selected categories, but also if you wanna train yourself to play hands you don't normally think about. If you like this video, give me a thumbs up. If you haven't subscribed to my channel, consider subscribing. Click the little gray bell if you do. That way you'll get notification for when I post new videos and you won't miss an opportunity to learn a new strategy or pick up an insight to the game that could give you an advantage at the table. Between now and the next video, may all your picks be keepers.